Hey, it's opening weekend. My name is Tony. The weekend is September 16th, and there are a whole bunch of new movies to uh, talk about and review right out of the theater. Confess Fletch is a remake of the Fletch movies with Chevy Chase. Let's see what people have to say. Got the movie kid here. You just came out of Confess Fletch with yeah. John Hamm. It was... Uh... Big shoes to fill. Chevy Chase, come on. Well, those shoes were... <laughs> Size 3? I don't want to be dramatic or sound like, you know, like I'm putting on a show, but the, mm -hmm. the movie just, it, he didn't fill those shoes. It happens. The movie, I, I, for those who don't know, it, it's based off of Fletch, which was a book, but it was also a movie series with, with you know, actor Chevy or Chevy Chase. I'm probably just pronouncing his name. Chevy know. Chase. Yeah, Chevy Chase. The one and only. Yes. Clark and, Griswold. You know, the movie Fletch basically follows, you know, the original follows Chevy Chase as an investigative reporter solving a mystery. Right. Or, yeah, he's an investigative reporter. And he's a snarky guy. Yeah, he's kind of snarky, you know. And, and the movie, it's more of a, it, it's a serious movie, but it does have comedic elements. Mostly from John Hamm. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, I'm talking about the original, but even this new one yeah, that yeah. came out, it, it's it, it kind of takes from the source material, but it deviates too much. Yeah. John Hamm plays Fletch. You know, a former investigative reporter. Yeah. And, you know, he comes back from a Europe trip, and, you know, within the first few minutes of the movie, he finds a dead body. Yeah. So that leads him through a couple he, of mysteries that are, you know, covered in the movie. They think it was him, hence the title, I guess, Confess Fletch. Yeah, yeah. You know, they instantly think it's him because obviously yeah. you know, he finds the body, as, you know, any detective would, would assume. Right. But. The biggest complaint I have with the movie is that in trying to replicate Chevy Chase's, you know, uh, snarkiness and sarcasm... <laughs> he overdoes it? He overdoes it. Like, you can yeah. tell he definitely, like, watched or at least knows... The that was his warm-up, watching uh, the two Chevy Chase uh, yeah, and vehicles. You know, he, he definitely, like, there are some things that are going to make you laugh, and, you know, the movie does go in a more comedic direction versus its predecessors, but... Yeah. I, I feel like it overdoes it, and in doing that, it it doesn't help the fact that the plot is kind of messy. Yeah. Some of the plot elements are briefly resolved in, like, a two-minute scene here and there. <laughs> and it's, you know, some people might like that. But the big appeal behind Fletch is that in making it a thinking movie, it links the pieces very neatly for you. And with Confess Fletch those same pieces aren't linked as nice if that makes any sense i'm kind of going i'm rambling on and on that's eh, okay I, I know you usually it's when, not a perfect movie is what you're trying to say yeah usually when you talk to me we go back and forth but i just yeah. i don't know like i was expecting a little bit more of this movie yeah and it just left me feeling a little bit like disappointed i will say though that there are two good parts about the movie i don't want okay. to completely criticize it the cast is quite strong sure it's an interesting and unique cast of people i really appreciate that and when it does make you laugh, it's a good laugh. It, it's I, an earned laugh. It's an earned laugh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I would say it definitely does that. But it's not enough for me to say it's a good movie overall. It's enough for me to say take your chances. Gotcha. Do I think it's worth the $20 rental at home? Oh. No. No. Is it worth maybe seeing it at AMC or Regal or wherever right. you are? Yeah. If you got a pass and you got time to kill. It wouldn't hurt. Take your chances, I would yeah. say. All right, cool. Yep. Thanks a lot, sir. That okay. was the movie kid. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed it.